What is going on guys and today I'm bringing you another video with this one We have five sets of trading methods all five of them will have different price ranges But will make you a ton of coins I figured since we've got a lot of new subs We've probably got a lot of people who have a different amount of coins So we're gonna try a few different players that have a few different price ranges Which means all of you can do them to make a ton of coins if you do enjoy make sure to drop a like down below If you're new around here subscribe we're on our way to 3k already We've got 70 subs in the last like two or three days which for me is massive I know like like for bigger channels it's not but for me that's huge so i really appreciate that so if you're new around here subscribe put those notifications on if you enjoy the video drop a like down below drop a comment down below if you've got anything you'd like to see from me without further ado let's get into the video So guys, rather than what I usually do, which is pick up as many players as possible in sort of a two minute span as I can, we're gonna pick up pretty much one or two of each player. Now, what we've done is we've got five French players. We're going with a theme today, and we're gonna show you, basically all of them are different rated, so all of them have very different price ranges. They're also, some of them are relevant still, some of them aren't. So you'll see different price ranges, and you'll see how to snipe different styles of players. So first we have Komen. We've got a few defenders in here. We've got a few attackers and a mid fielder as well so we're gonna have a look see how much he's going for I reckon you can pick him up for about 7,000 coins on a snipe let's have a look let's see I haven't actually checked a lot of the price ranges. I just know a lot of the players are good to snipe. So this guy might be going way less than I thought he was. So let's have a look. I thought he was going for way more than this. Okay, so 5.9 there. We don't know if that was a snipe yet because we haven't checked his actual value. So he looks like he's going for around 6K maybe. Let's have a look. So 6.2. Let's have a look. 6.3 is where he's sitting. 6.4. So 640 coins divided by 2. It's 320, so EA tax is gonna be about 320 coins. So we can pick him up really for anything under 6K and make a profit. So we're gonna go for that. And that's basically, in my head, you can kind of hear out loud the maths there of how I work out how the profit's gonna be. You've got 6.4 is what he's selling for. So EA tax is 5%, so I work out 10% and then just half it. So 10% of 6.4 is 640, and then we're left with the 320 EA tax. Now hopefully we can pick him up quite quickly. We've already seen one for 5.9, so hopefully we can get one for six or anything less, and then we can move on to the next player. Now this video might be split up because I am going out for a meal in like five minutes, so I'm not sure when I'm getting picked up for that. So this video could be split up into two, and I might be back and then after that or whatever so i don't know how late this video is going to come out but hopefully it comes out at a reasonable time for you guys i'm just going to check it seems so we've got the 6.3 there we've got loads of 6.4 could we do the compare price method or we get that one there you go straight away 5.9 so we're going to sell him for 6,000. 400 and uh, because he's got a chemistry style and a position change up that's either going to make him go up in price or down now i think because he's a left forward it's not as good as if he was a left wing uh, but it is still a position change and it is a chemistry style so it is a positive now moving on we're going to have a look at the next place so we've gone for Komen, and then we're going to go for mendy now there are two french mendy's and we're going to go for the real madrid one so let's have a look mendy it's furland mendy i believe and how much is he actually going for these days 20k still so he's well 10k clearly uh he's still going for quite a bit i do have his footmas cards a lot of you will know uh, some of you may know i tried to do a video on that my computer crashed so that was pretty good for me and um, we've got 11k there okay so he's got he's realistically he's going for about 12. um let's see how much he really is going for 12 500 so 11 500 there's a few so we're looking at 11 500 so 1150 basically 600 coins EA tax. So there is where EA tax is. We go down there and that's a 200 coin profit on any card we pick up. Let's see if we can get one of these right off the bat, 10K straight away. Oh, that one, you can see that one was close because when you get the orange tick or the orange X, it means you've basically been beat by like a millisecond, which is pretty annoying. But as you can see there, the first one came up. We got one for 10K, which would have been a nice little profit there. We're gonna go for another one. A lot of you might not know, but this is a sniping method where you go on here and you just go down here and then you just wanna go on your D-pad and click Y and A, rather than having to constantly search how you did last year. This does make it a little bit easier, but you wanna be careful that you're not doing it too fast otherwise you will be booted off the market let's see if we can get one here go on and 8.2 oh that would have been such a good snipe 
okay we're gonna move on to come on one more oh that's with an anchor right that's gonna go for a little bit more because what did we work out as it was just over 11k wasn't it so it's 11 500 i'm gonna put him up for 12 because he's got an anchor on which is basically one of the best chemistry styles you can have now that shadow's so hard, so hard to come by we're gonna move on to the next player we've got Halla. Now he is, well, how many have I listed down here? I've got five here. Uh, and then for the next video, I'm gonna do, instead of a theme of a certain nationality, we're gonna go for a certain price range. So make sure to check that out. So this one, of course, much lower than the rest. We're looking at about, I think that's probably a snipe. How much is he going for? Oh, okay, yeah, that definitely was a snipe. I didn't realize how much he was going for. Let's have a look, 2.6. So it's 130 coins EA tax. Uh, no, that'd be, Ah, oh, we missed that one there. How much is the A tax? I need to work that out before we keep sniping. 2,400, 2,000. So it's 125 coins EA tax on this one because he's going for 2.5. So we want to go about 2.3 and pick up anything below. Let's have a look. Straight away, 1.5, let's go. Ah, oh, we've missed a few good snipes here, but usually I do my sniping around like six, seven, um, which is probably the most active time to market. If you really want to get good snipes, it's difficult because if you do it at the more quiet times, there's less cards being uploaded. I'm just gonna make sure I've not missed uh, my lift. Um, there's less cards being uploaded, which is obviously means that there's less deals going, but then also at the same time, there's a lot of less people kind of beating you to those deals. So it is difficult to choose when to snipe. Go on one more, let's go for that one. Oh my God, how have we not got that? I think because he's an 83, he's probably being sniped a little bit more uh, because they're used way more for SBCs. Whereas like Komen and Mendy, they won't be used for SBCs because of their rating versus the amount they cost. Let's go, that one there. So we got that one for 2K. He's selling on for 2.5, so that's a pretty nice profit there. Um, I hope you guys like this format where I'm picking up five players rather than three. I just figured now the channel's gone up in subs, we'll try and go up in quality as well. So I hope you guys enjoy that. If you do, make sure to drop a like down below, drop a comment. All of your comments, like I do read all of them pretty much as soon as you comment them. I'm on my phone probably 20% of the day, 20%, 24-7 really. So if I'm honest, I'll probably see the comments straight away. So if you do have any improvements or anything like that, don't be afraid to put them down because I am all here for feedback and criticism just so I can improve my videos for you guys. Um, we're gonna have a look at, let's have a look at this one, 8.5, 8.5. So he's probably going around, what, 8.7? So for the final player, we are looking at Dembele and Diallo. Now, obviously, there was a little bit of a gap there. I've just gone for a meal and came back. And we're going to quickly pick up one of each of these. And I'm pretty sure I know Dembele's price is at about 7K. And I think Diallo is going to be at about 1K. So these two are going to be a little bit more rushed because I'm going to try and get this out. It's currently 9.50. Usually, I go for videos around 6. So this is a bit late for me. Um, but we're going to try and pick up as many as possible quickly as possible so let's have a look 8.7 there so it's 8600 i think he's going for which means 430 coin ea tax we'll take it down by 500 to make minimum profit and then we're going to literally go for one on this one and then go for diallo and that'll be the end of the video so we're going to try and pick up one as quickly as possible go on oh, we missed that one we're gonna go for one more and then we are gonna move on just because I am pushed for time. I'm gonna try and get this out as quickly as possible. Yesterday's video actually got a lot more views than usual. So I don't know if that means I've got more American views now or what that means, but hopefully um, I can get back on track for tomorrow and get regular time videos. Come on, get one of these. if we get down to 9.9 .9 and we haven't picked one up we're gonna move over to Diallo because I know he's a lot easier to snipe and we are doing it a bit late for the UK market uh, let's go one more come on there's gotta be another one. Oh, there actually is one oh, as you can see though there are some six snipes with Dembele that one for 6k would have been a very nice profit there we're gonna go for Diallo who I think holds around 4k usually but i think that might be wrong okay he's obviously gone down a little bit okay so he's way cheaper than i thought is he now unsnipable oh he's literally going for like nothing so we're going to replace diallo very quickly with someone a lot cheaper 
um, who is of a way smaller budget, but oh, have I got the name wrong? Guendouzi. Now he was in yesterday's video, and he actually goes for actually would seem a little bit more than Diallo. Um, so he's at around a K. I picked him up yesterday for around 600 coins. So he's probably the lowest budget person you will find in this video. So at 1K, he's going to go with a 50 coin EA tax. So we're going to take it down to 900 and see if we can get one quickly. And that guy is probably the easiest one to snipe, to be honest, because we picked one up yesterday for I think around 600 and it sold for a K, which is obviously a really good profit. Also, he's non-rare, which the thing with Diallo is even though he goes for like 950 coins, you can't pick him up for less than 700. So it really isn't much point sniping him. Whereas Gwen Doozy, you do have a chance to get actually a fairly decent profit up to just under a K. So we're going to have a go again one of him if there's going to be one on the market. We've got the free here. Compare price maybe. Is that going to work? Obviously, 10 o'clock at night probably isn't the best time to be sniping on the English market, I think. I don't know if it is too local or just the fact that so many players just go to sleep because most of the players on this game are from the United Kingdom. Uh, we're going to go for one Guendouzi and then we are done. Okay, so that's all done. We can't find one, but obviously, as you can see, Dembele and the other four would have been fine. Obviously, Guendouzi is really good, but I don't have the time to snipe him in order to get this video out on time. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Make sure to drop a like down below if you have. Check out the guys who do my music in the description down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.